to Free World Investing. Today we're going to be going over how to set alarms for the MACD indicator. Now the MACD indicator is a little bit harder to set alarms on than your normal support and resistance levels because you have the crossing right here. And a lot of times you want to trade the crossing but you could also trade at certain levels if you're trying to do overbought and oversold levels on the MACD indicator itself. First we're going to show you how to do it with the crossing. For the crossing you're going to come over to here to the MACD and you're going to right click. And when you right click, it allows you to add an alert on the MACD. You're going to hit add alert. And then once you add the add that, you're going to use the MACD. And you're going to choose MACD crossing. You're going to choose instead of a value, you're going to choose another MACD and then you could choose signal. And now remember, this is only for the time frame that you choose. So that is really important. And then you're going to choose your options depending on how you want to trade it and where you want this sent to you. If you're not familiar with this program, this is TradingView. If you use the links in my description, I'd be very appreciative. It will help me bring you more content. And then there should be a create button. You can't see it on uh, your screen right now, but there's a create button right below this description box right here. And then you just hit create and it creates it itself. And once you have it created, it'll show up on this side right here. It should pop up here any second. And now that is not the only way to trade. So we're going to delete this alert right here. And I'm going to show you another way to set the alarm. Now remember, to do the crossing, you just have to choose the MACD line, which is the blue line right here, crossing the signal line, the orange line. Now if you want to, now if you want to do it to get overbought or sell levels, you want to use a horizontal line and put the horizontal line where on the value that you wish it to have an alarm and what you do you set that and you can double click it or you can right click and choose the value from the alarm screen for this case we're just going to double click it it gets us to the alert and then you choose MACD and then you choose which line the MACD line or the signal line you could build two lines and do both if wanted and that's as e that's how easy it is to set up alarms for your MACD hopefully this helped you with your trading and if it did please like and subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more great content. Have a great day.